Hey, it's Clay Trader, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol NWBO. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. Real quick, what do I mean by 30 minute in case maybe you're new to charts? Instead of each one of these candlesticks here representing one day's worth of price action, which is what you would normally see, each one represents 30 minutes. So while this here may look like several days worth of time, it's actually just today's price action broken down into 30 minute time slices. I like you this time frame. I think that's a good job of telling the quote unquote story of the price and then makes mapping out levels of support and resistance a bit easier to see. I don't mean to state the obvious, but I will anyways. Absolutely monster move today, not only from a price action perspective, but more so I'd probably argue from a volume perspective. When you look down here at the amount of volume that actually came in during the day, biggest volume this chart has had in quite a while. And you know that's gonna be the lifeblood of any chart is the volume. So volume came in strong, definitely a good sign. So let's first start by talking about some areas of support. And the first area is what I would call the ideal level of support. Meaning if you say, hey Clay, what would make this chart look the absolute strongest going forward? And that would be if the price can stay up above 18 cents. Now, don't get me wrong. If the price falls below 18, by no means am I saying the entire chart's ruined or anything like that. But yeah, if the price can manage to stay up above there, that would definitely be the best case scenario uh, in terms of power for the bulls. Now, taking a step back, looking at the big picture of things, it's all about the purple line right there, which is the 50 period simple moving average. So if you're somebody that cares about more so the big picture and you just want a, a way to apply the KISS method, keep it simple, stupid, then just use that purple line. As that purple line moves itself higher and higher, as long as the price stays above it, then the bulls are in full control, the bulls are in full health, full control. However you can best visualize that, that is what that is representing. Again, if the price can stay above 18 cents, that is ideal, but from the grand scheme of things, as long as the price is above that purple line, then the overall trend is fully in the bulls' favor. Now, what about areas of resistance? Pretty straightforward at this point in time, it's all about where the party stopped today and that's up there at the 19 cent mark. So 18 cents, the ideal level of support, overall support, trend indicator, that 50 period simple moving average and then uh, 19 cents is where the sellers are currently hanging out at. But anyway, you slice it, nice move today. Now it's just a matter of can the bulls build upon this momentum going forward? We shall see. One of the biggest questions that I get is, hey Clay, how do you find the stocks that you trade? So what I've done is put together a free resource guide where I talk about the tools that I use to locate stocks that I find interesting and think may have potential. So if that sounds like something that could add value to you as a trader, then click on the image that is up on the screen right now and I will email you the guide. The guide itself is very short and to the point and best part, it's completely free. Thanks for watching the video. Let me know if you have any questions.